they're used to washing machines for laundry, dirty dishes, and cars. But a washing machine for pets? Yeah, it's, you know, today's instant society. We want fast food, we want dogs washed fast, and we don't want to do it. And so, dog owner John Starr puts Boomer in the pet spa. As the spray hits from the top, bottom, and all three sides, Boomer settles in for a good cleaning. Well, what do your customers say when you ask them if they want to have a spa? Some people wouldn't dream of letting a machine do the work. And on the other end of the spectrum, people couldn't be happier to put their dog or cat in the machine, start the process, and then run across the street for coffee. <laughs> <laughs> but some pet owners find it tough to relax as they watch their pets disappear in the spray. I was very anxious. Incredible anxiety, actually. Um, my dog's from life. Located at Vermont Pets in Long Beach, California, the pet spot's attracting a lot of attention. Dog owners bringing their pets in for traditional grooming. Can't wait to take a peek at new machine. This is like teaching our old dog new tricks, you know? I can't believe it. It's like you always hear stories about don't put your kids in the washer. And you know, I mean, those little jokes they make, but it is kind of like one of those front open washers. The pet spa was designed by animal behaviorists, veterinarians, and engineers with the safety and well-being of the pets in mind. Water and air temperatures are computer controlled. Has anything really bad ever happened inside that pet spa? Not here since arrived. And Fido didn't have a heart attack? No, of course not. We've never had to stop the machine and take an animal out because they just were too stressed out or not able to cope. Anyone yeah. knows grooming a cat isn't easy. This one is named Oliver. So when you try to wash them and dry them at home... I'll run straight from the shower, get under the bed, and then it's impossible. You have to, you know, move the bed out from under the wall, and he gets all the lint from under the bed. You, you can't sweep under the bed. So, so he's so dirty again. A dirty all over again, yeah. <laughs> That's what happens when Oliver is put in the pet spa. He disappeared. He's a little uncomfortable at this point, probably. Yeah. But, I mean, they call it a spa. It can't be that bad. Would you go in? I would go in. You know, I, I would never make Oliver do something that I wouldn't do myself. To demonstrate the spa's safety, owner Air Patch took the plunge. It's awesome. <laughs> Warm water from all directions. It's a gentle spray. It feels good. It costs from $12 to $15 per wash, which is about half of what you'd pay a professional to pay dog. According to Zinke's owner, the machine seems to do the job. Yes, right. looks good. We'll check for the hidden treasure. It's gone. Excellent. Very good. What other kind of pets are capable of riding the spa? I had somebody ask, could you wash my pot-bellied pig in there? And uh, I suppose if uh, the pig wasn't too large, that uh, it could be baked in the pet spa as well. For the early show, Hattie Kaufman, CBS News, Long Beach, California.